Hello everyone and how's it going? My name is Mini Show and I'm playing some Call of Duty Black Ops. This is probably going to be one of my last, well not last Black Ops video, but I have a couple more to show and I'm actually proud to, to tell you guys that I am going to be updating, uh, not updating, updating uh, pretty regularly now. Not every day, but like probably like every other day. I don't know, I feel like I am want to get back into the YouTube mood and I think I... I'm going to start posting way more videos than I used to, even when I was posting uh, at least once a week. But uh, I'm going to try and keep up a regular thing, and I hope you guys are down for me for doing that. And if so, uh, just throw a little like right now. No, I'm kidding. I'm not going to ask for likes on this video. Oh, well, I probably would, but anyways, I am, I don't know, I'm really excited for Modern Warfare 3 to come out less than a week. The thing that I'm kind of disappointed though is that people are already playing the game. I guess somehow people uh, have, I don't know, it's, it's shipped already. And I don't know, just for some reason people have already received it. I'm guessing people uh, didn't follow the rules and uh, let it out on November 8th like it's supposed to be. But other than that, all this news about the game and all the guns and all that stuff is coming out. And it's actually sounds like it's gonna be quite a fun game I heard it's very fast-paced and that's like my pretty much my play style that I really enjoyed and that's pretty much my strategy for any of these first-person shooters is just to just to go out have fun run and gun just take names and just that's just I think that's the best way to play this game that's really my pro tip for anyone to play any first-person shooter I know I haven't really even played Battlefield 3 yet and I don't know if I'm really going to enjoy it. I've seen videos on it and stuff and I don't know, just just for me it's just not the type of game well it is the type of game I would play but it's just it looks like it's going to be way too slow paced and one race, no I'm not going to do quick scopes in Battlefield 3 or I probably would but <laughs> I thought that was funny when you commented on last video for that but other than that, I'm doing great. My uh, my midterms and all that stuff have finished, so now I'm just working on projects and playing computer games as I am still playing League of Legends. But once November 8th comes around, it is going to be Modern Warfare 3 all day, every day. And I'm going to put the team on my back every single game. If you guys ever want to play with me, just send a friend request to a mini show, and it's for Xbox Live and I don't know I'm just really excited and I'm just gonna be hopefully this t time uh, ma a friend or inviting friends will be a lot easier than last year Black Ops was pretty much unplayable with friends you pretty much had to go um, by yourself into every match because you usually drop someone or anything like that but I don't know I just can't express my excitement for this for this game I don't know there's just something about it that just like it's gonna give me like a first time ever playing Call of Duty feeling I hope and I think it might will and I do say that Call of Duty World at War is still my favorite Call of Duty ever made I did enjoy Call of Duty Modern Warfare but I don't know it's just my personal opinion and I think Treyarch's game was the least out of all of them for Call of Duty Black Ops. I think it's the least amount of time played I've played on one of Call of Duty. I didn't prestige the last prestige. And I don't know. I'm still debating for Modern Warfare 3 if I should prestige or not. And what are your thoughts about prestiging in the system? Like, a 15, I think it's 15 or 16. It's something ridiculous. I, for one, really want to get all the golden guns. I want to get all the just every attachment for every gun like that's just seems so good like get all the the perks all the pro perks like everything just pro but then like I don't know just for some reason I'm at one point I'm just like okay I want to try something new I want to do like brand new fresh gameplay and I don't know just for some reason that just always astonishes me what prestige actually does for you and how it actually doesn't make you an addict but it's a very good way of uh, making you enjoy something even longer 
because I guess for the way of making it, it just makes gameplay fresher because you have to start everything new. You kind of are like competitive on ranking up your weapons, your levels, and like, I, I don't know, I've done this so many times where like I have like three levels to prestiging and then like I play all night just because I want to get to that get to that moment and just prestige in that next and just that feeling of like accomplishment of going to another thing is really cool and I really enjoy that feeling and it's just really interesting I'm pretty sure that's how other people feel too and I don't know that's just my take on the whole prestiging system I think this was a brilliant idea that they incorporated I don't think any other game can can use that style anymore because it's used so often already but <laughs> the video is over and you cut it short my name is Minisho and thank you for watching bye